So this is Psalm 107, Thanksgiving for God's deliverance. Give thanks to the Lord for he is good. His faithful love endures forever. Let the redeemed of the Lord proclaim that he has redeemed them. Hallelujah and amen. From the hand of the foe, it has gathered them from the lands, from the east and from the west and, the west and from the north and the south. Some wandered in the desolate wilderness, finding no way to a city where they could live. They were hungry and thirsty. Their spirits failed within them. Then they cried out to the Lord in their trouble. He rescued them from their distress. He led them by the right path to go to a city where they could live. Let them give thanks to the Lord for his faithful love and his wonderful works for all humanity. For he has satisfied the thirsty and filled the hungry with good things. Others sat in darkness and gloom prisoners in cruel chains because they rebelled against God's commands and despised the counsel of the Most High. He broke their spirits with hard labor. They stumbled, or it says hearts. It's another way to translate that. It says they stumbled and there was no one to help. Then they cried out to the Lord in their trouble. He saved them from their distress. He brought them out of the darkness and gloom and broke their chains apart. Let them give thanks to the Lord for his faithful love and his wonderful works for all humanity. For he has broken down the bronze gates and cut through the iron barns, bars. Hallelujah. <clears throat> Fools suffered affliction because of their rebellious ways and their sins. They loathed all food and came near the gates of death. And they cried out to the Lord in their trouble. He saved them from their distress. He sent his word and healed them. He rescued them from the pit. Let them give thanks to the Lord for his faithful love and his wonderful works for all humanity. Let them offer sacrifices and thanksgivings and announce his works with shouts of joy. Hallelujah. Others went to sea in ships, conducting trade on the vast waters. They saw the Lord's works, his wonderful works in the deep. He spoke and raised a tempest that stirred up the waves of the sea, rising up to the sky, sinking down to the depths, their courage melting away, or souls melting away in anguish. They reeled and staggered like drunken men, and all their skill was useless. Then they cried out to the Lord in their trouble. He brought them out of their distress. He stalled, he stalled the storm or stilled the storm, rather, to a murmur. And the waves of the sea, or the waves of them, were hushed. They rejoiced when the waves grew quiet. Then he guided them to the harbor they, they longed for. Let them give thanks to the Lord for his faithful love and his wonderful works for all humanity. <clears throat> Sorry, I lost my place for you, you guys. Let them exalt in the assembly of the people and praise in the council of the elders. He turns rivers into deserts, springs of water into thirsty ground, and fruitful land into salty wasteland because of the wickedness of, it, of its inhabitants. He turns a desert into a pool of water, dry land into springs of water, and he causes the hungry to settle there, and they establish a city where they can live. They sow fields and plant vineyards. That he yield that yield a fruitful harvest. Hallelujah and amen. He blesses them and they multiply greatly. He does not let their livestock decrease when they are diminished and are humbled by cruel oppression and sorrow. He pours contempt on nobles and makes them wander in a trackless wasteland. But he lifts the needy out of their suffering and makes their families multiply like flocks. The upright see it and rejoice, hallelujah, and all injustice shuts its mouth. Let whoever is wise pay attention to these things and consider the Lord's acts of faithful love. Hallelujah and amen. He does. His love is so faithful and he does love us and it's eternal. Hallelujah and amen. I love you guys too. Bye. God bless you.